and keep your fingers out of the... All right, today we're looking at cheap gun cases, 1098 at Walmart. I got two of them, but I'm only gonna be able to use one because I only got one gun with me. Now, I bought these because they're pretty heavy duty plastic. Yeah, they're cheap, but I don't care. I go to the gun range. It's not like I'm actually gonna go hunting. I don't need something higher quality than these. See how they move? It's not solid. It's cheap like uh, toy plastic. I do have a rifle. It is a Marlin Model 60 with a scope that I'm going to take out of its own case and put in here and see if it fits. And I'm pretty certain it will fit, but I'm gonna keep the scope on it because I am not one of those kinds of people that like taking the scope on and off and having to lug around a big, big screwdriver with me. It's not a big screwdriver, I'm just too lazy to actually lug around a screwdriver with me everywhere because I do that with my phone case and it's really annoying. But here it is, here's the length of it. It's got the scope on it. I'm gonna open it up right here. It has four latches. One, two, three, four. Two for each side. Pop open. Pop open. Pop open. Pop open. And it's got two pieces of foam. One for each side. What you'll do is lay the gun down on either side it fits with the scope on it doesn't go the whole way which is great you don't want to go the whole way in this padding boom boom lock it up now these cases obviously are not meant to last forever they're not it's not that heavy it'll be as heavy as the gun you put in it um, you can try and put some shotguns in here the long, long shotguns will not fit. You'll need an extra two inches of this because I tried earlier with a different one. And now I'm going to do a test of how heavy it is to heave around. So you can just stay there while I walk and just aim the camera at me. It's not really that heavy. This piece doesn't move too much. It does move a little bit because there's not like a locking seam. But it's really not that bad. Now for the left arm. Yeah, it's not that bad. Uh, it does move just a little bit, but the locks will keep it in place. If you drop this, um, I was told at, at Walmart that I got from, you drop these once, they're probably done on the seams. They're probably just done. You drop them twice, and if it survives the first one, it's probably just going to split in half and you'll have to get a new one. But as of right now, I would say this is a great uh, deal for $10.98 at Walmart um, after taxes, uh, Indiana State tax. It might be more or less where you live. Yeah, these are great. I highly recommend it. I'm going to sit this down. It didn't break. I'm going to pick it back up. Switch hands. Didn't break. I'm going to be a little bit more rough. Didn't break. That's your durability test. I'm Ross from History and Reviews. Joe and Ross's and Maddox's. And I'm going shooting. And Red Dot.